Dude, you, uh, uh, for a whole year, he acted like I didn't even exist. He wouldn't even say my name. He wouldn't even say anything. He wouldn't even think about me. So now it's like, oh, you want, you want to fight now? It, it would just, it would be crazy to me. Now now we're moving forward uh, to TFEMO. The, the fight with TFEMO makes all the in the world for the real undisputed. And uh, yeah. Hey, for me, look, I got to say it like this, though. Show me something. You had your opportunity with Gamboa, 38 years old. You couldn't do nothing. You couldn't do nothing. What does that show? What does that show for everybody else out there? If you want to come at me, you better be ready. And that's all I got to say for everybody coming 2021. I'm coming out there to take your head off. And that's on God. I remember once upon a time, Devin Haney, Devin Haney couldn't find no fights. Devin Haney was looking through the smoke. He was walking through the smoke and nobody was in the smoke. Now, fast forward to 2023 of July. Devin Haney can't get, he, it's just almost too smoke for him, too much smoke for him to handle, right? It's just too much smoke. Everybody's trying to fight Haney now. Haney, this is what you want, right? This is what he wanted. You know, everybody wants to fight Devin the Dream Haney. Devin Haney's the man. And when you got all the leverage, this tends to happen. But Tiafimo Lopez, as we know, apparently retired, right? He was talking about retirement. He's talking a lot of trash on his way out, right? But he seemed to have made a U-turn. And now, he's calling out Devin the Dream Haney. And yeah, Tiafimo Lopez, um, over the years, man, you know, I've been, I pay attention to the energy, the body language, the eyes, right? The, the 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 everything he never really wanted no smoke with Devin Haney never wanted that smoke he was looking for every excuse in the world to not have to deal with Devin the Dream Haney every excuse in the world right but Tiffimo Lopez says this yo at real Devin Haney actually tags him since you were so quick to jump in the mix for my WBO championship belt let's make the fight happen so the world can see who's about that action and no you will not be the A side I hold the king title of the division as well so don't run away bitch Wow. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Now, I admit, Tiafimo Lopez looked really, really good in his fight with Josh Taylor. Looked really good, right? Devin Haney responds by saying, let's do it. And then, Tiafimo Lopez says, came out of retirement, I guess, because the next move was for Devin Haney to fight sorry-ass Arnold Barbosa for my WBO championship title at 140 pounds. Now, WBO was looking to put pressure on Devin Haney they denied his extension so the WBO is looking to probably strip Devin Haney or force him to fight somebody you know maybe Arnold Barbosa at 140 pounds or maybe somebody at 135 pounds whatever the case <sighs> they looking like they putting pressure on Dev but Devin Haney reacts to T. Fimo Lopez and says this he said yo he says yo 304 ass never retired in the first place let's see if you really want the smoke I'm going to be 140 champ regardless. You asked for 20 million last time my pops talked to you. Wow. <laughs> wow. 20 million, um, T.O.? 20 million, bro? 20 million. That's like heavyweight fight money. All right? That's like what the bronze bomber typically gets when he fights a, 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 a solid opponent. You know what I'm saying? Like 20 million? That's heavyweight, like... 20 million to come on bro that are you are you really serious about it 20 million like who where they go get 20 million from for for that what for that fight that, no that's not gonna happen to you but tifima lopez been talking a lot of trash now devin haney want to get in that ass pause right i mean devin haney got a lot of options a shit ton of options devin haney probably got the most options and some of the best options in boxing right now especially as a young champion so salute to him man for you know, getting himself into position. I mean, we seen Devin Haney's come up, and it wasn't looking good, right? If, if, if things didn't play out the way it did, if Devin Haney didn't make the moves he made, he could have been one of those guys like Demetrius Bubu Andre, right? But Devin Haney bit the bullet on a few occasions, took the B-side offer, you know, went over there to Australia and made something happen, and now he's the top captain, right? So, yeah, man, Devin Haney got a lot of options, man. This is good for Dev. This is good for Bill, the Haney's. Um, man, Tiafimo Lopez talking a lot of trash, man. You know, and we all assumed that he likely wasn't going to retire for real. But will the fight happen this year? I don't know. I definitely want to see it. Like, subscribe, hot your boy. Peace out.